All right, and last and certainly least in my humble opinion is Jacob and Esau. So we've made it all the way around the wheel. Our final stop here uh, before we have to come up with something new to do is Jacob and Esau. So let's get this party started. I mean, these guys, they don't play like any other character. Not even close. You got two of them, and boy, oh boy, are they something, huh? These, these two brothers. All right, good start, though. So, yeah, it's going to be a struggle. As you can see, you know, they all they both have independent stats. And uh, when you pick up items, it goes to independent parties. So, each one starts with, like, a, a generic strength. One of them has higher tier rate and damage. Or, yeah, one has higher tier rate, one has higher damage. You know, stuff like that. Um, and I'm not really sure what my strategy is going to be. Uh, sometimes it's to just pimp out one guy and have him be the damage dealer. And then just keep the other one alive. Sometimes it's just give each one some items. I'm not sure yet. I think Mr. Boom is fine on either guy. We'll give it to Jacob. Ooh. So range up immediately. I'm going to give it to the guy with the less range. So now they're both very equal. I think that's a smart move. That's definitely one. Oh, boy. Okay. We avoided it. I think that's a smart move. Pupula duplex now gives you spectral. Uh, I'm fine giving that to probably Esau here. I think that's Esau. I honestly don't really remember who's who. Sorry. Alright, let's see who we've got in here to fight. It's Widow, so luckily it's a low HP enemy. Uh, unluckily it's a fast enemy. <laughs> so if we get split up, you know, you're on your own, guys. I'm sorry. I'm just going to hope for the best. We're making good headway, though. So... Oh, yeah, there you go. Classic. And luckily, though, it's the guy who had red hearts, so I feel okay with that. Um, but as I was about to say, good first floor. You know, we got some range distributed to a new character. And who do I want to have that tears up first? Um, red guy has lower tier rate and lower shot speed, so I think let's catch him up a little bit. How's that sound? Oh! <laughs> I didn't see him. He was bl blending in like an absolute magician on that one. And BFFs is cool. Uh, if we can make it work, you know, I'm, I'm totally in. But, again, 15 cents. Not necessarily likely. The item room, of course, has... Ah, oh, Roid Rage. So, Roid Rage is good. Uh, how good? Well, uh, let's see. Who, who do we really want to have spun? I mean, we can try giving it to this bloke. Um, the nice thing about speed ups is that it's just straight up gives you like a halfy. So I feel good about it. It's money, and ooh, it's enough money actually for BFFs. So I'll certainly have to consider that before I go crazy. Um, we'll give BFFs to Jacob, and then if any familiars show up, that'll be the guy we give them to. So he'll. You know, that's, you know, that's a fair price to pay, I suppose, to be Jacob. That makes sense, right? I mean, I'll just be the familiar guy. So maybe if the Incubus shows up, you know, that's really good. Uh, it kind of would hurt a little bit. Because we actually do have more HP on... Or we do have more damage on the other guy. Uh, and we're going to wait to pick that up. And it's Ouija board, so... Identify uh, who's got the lower tier rate, and we'll just go from there, I suppose. Um... I'm looking at it, and it looks like it's actually this fella. So, yeah. Okay. Our tier rates are improving. Uh, that's good news. And then we're going to go ahead and try to... Oh, ugh, I tried to give that to the other one. I was not very quick on the sticks on that one. That's annoying. Oh, that is real solid. Because he's not paying, so... Queen of Hearts it is. Holy, Okay. All for, all for one more play. That's amazing. That is actually amazing. Okay, well, good enough for me. And here's where we kind of go a little crazy. We're actually going to go down to the downpour for a single floor uh, just to try it. I want to show you guys the power of double item rooms for this character. We're going to be able to pick up two items now. Oh. Okay, solid. And uh, I just want to, I want to put that on display before we get too far down the line here. It's the boss is Wormwood, who is tricky. 
Oh, hello. I tricked you with two people, that is, but I can drop a bomb on him. Oh, that hit me. Who did that hit? Oh, the red guy. Uh, okay, he needs to luck up, so we'll just we'll just go ahead and divvy that up now. And we did get a deal with the devil. It's a Thame. Uh, that's really solid. And it's Lemmageddon. Yeah, man, Lemmageddon's good. So we'll do it. We'll get Lemmageddon. And that is all she wrote. Now we get to go to the item room, which we actually haven't found yet. All right, so we're going to also give the random item to uh, Mr. Whatever, and it ends up being Leech, which is cool. Totally good. And right now, actually, we're going to get both of them to pick up the book, so it's Bookworm. Oh, no, it doesn't work that way. Okay. Fair enough. Wow, Spoonbender out of Lemmageddon. That is going to be really good if I can hold on to it. Uh, it's, I mean, it's unlikely, you know, because eventually I will lose it. But for now, it's really sweet. Tech point five. He is getting pimped out with Lemmageddon. Uh, homing adds a ton for a Thame and tech point five. So we're looking really strong right now off of Jacob. Okay, oh, well, all right, well, that solves my problem. Who's going to pick that up? <laughs> Item room is explosivo, huh? Mm, ah, I feel like, did I come around to this item? I honestly don't remember. I don't remember if I like this item or not. We're going to try it, though. Oh, 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 okay. <laughs> it's Husk, low HP guy. Oh, he's the speedster, though, so we got to be careful. Uh, and this acquisition of homing is phenomenal. If I, I need to be able to keep it, though. That's the only thing. Who's got the lower tier rate? Actually, you do. We've gotten a lot of tiers ups on this run, which is really good. Um, and I'm kind of playing it with, like, I don't want one guy to hit the cap without, like, the other one having any work done. So I'm trying to keep it level in case, just in the off chance, either one of them gets an item that's better with tier rate. You know, I can live with two 3.5s. So that's, that's great. I don't want to have like a one, one at max and the other is just like garbage. Keeps my options open. That's what I'm trying to say. Why did he throw it all the way over there? That is such a jerk thing to do. Ooh. So Lost Soul actually with BFF is amazing because it's Holy Mantle. I gave it to the right guy. Okay. When he did, we spawned without one, I was like, no way. I just blew that. Okay. We're good. We're good. Um, that's insane. That will probably actually pay out several times. And we got a library too. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, so, we can definitely get Book of uh, Satan on the regiment. And I'll give it to Esau. Actually, I, I think I'm more interested in that because I think you're still good with Lemmageddon. Uh, so yeah, there we go. Uh, then now we just... Now we print. Now we're in a re really good spot. Okay. <laughs> good library. Holy cow. Hey, Lusty Blood. I mean, Lemmageddon's doing some numbers on us here. Giving us some real banger items. Alright, Triac- or Reap Creep. I always call him Triacnid. That's not true. Triacnid is the- what's that guy's name in the womb? Daddy Longlegs. The Daddy Longlegs alternate. Uh, oh, did I just lose? Did I lose anything? No. Hopefully not. Lemmageddon and Book of a Satanic Bible have been amazing. Uh, Kami Conception could also be really good. Uh, it's good enough to put on our friend, because if he does get hit enough times, that's, you know, that's pay. And we will take Gimpy. We will take Gimpy. Hey, Stapler, okay. So, neither one of these guys has actually gotten that much of a solid damage up. I know it looks like it because, um, Blood Oath, but we actually haven't gotten, like, an official one. Charge Baby. Alright, well, we'll give it, uh, we'll give it to my friend. I'll buy it because it's our last shop, and, uh, you know, we weren't actually able to do much with our money. And, no, not touching that with a five-foot pole. Thank you, though. Alright, Mom. You're going down. 
You're going down. So, I mean, all I really am worried about is keeping Lost Soul alive at this point. It's going to be tougher than usual. Because uh, it's kind of a cramped fight. And now that we've got an extra guy to move. Uh, but we did it. Okay, I feel great about that. And not only that, but we can do something better than usual. Uh, we can actually give... Okay, well, Esau should be the one with the damage up. He hasn't gotten any, I don't think. So we can get pull right and negative. So we're going to... Beauty. Love to see it. You really do. Uh, each guy gets an eternal heart now, uh, thanks to Lost Soul, and... Oh, Montezuma's Revenge, you say? <laughs> yeah. Uh, we'll go here. We'll just even out the, the playing field a little bit more. Ooh, Libra. That's a cool one. Oh, cool. Golden Child's Heart. And I will say, honestly, getting Libra with... The Lusty Blood character is honestly a pretty cool synergy that I was not necessarily expecting. Uh, Ghost Baby and Eye of the Occult, huh? Well, one of these guys can just take everything because he gets a ton of HP. So, well, let's do it. I mean, there's, there's no reason not to, I think, at this point. We'll just, we'll send it. Oh, it has to. <laughs> okay. Succubus, easy pickup, no questions there. And we're rocking and rolling, baby. We are really rocking and rolling. Alright, so we finally did make it to the boss. That was a long one, though, it felt like. And it lives. We are going to honestly probably do good work. I'm not going to lie. We have a really good setup here. It's just that same thing of, like... So, Lemmageddon is really good. Uh, the only thing that sucks is taking hits here. Because, like, I didn't want to lose any items. Uh, we got Buddy in the Box. We have a lot of familiars, actually, have been spawning from... <laughs> from Lemmageddon, which is fine. Because that's our, that's our BFF's uh, holder. So he's like, he's reaping all the benefits. And I actually don't want those. But thank you very much, uh, Lost Soul. Go ahead and give it to... Oh gosh, who do we want to give it to? Uh, the lower tier guy also happens to have the higher damage stat anyway. So we'll just, we'll do that. Oh, okay, so... We just did a little backtrack and that's all. So we'll let him get in for blue cap. Alright, I mean, man, what a run, huh? I can see, like, honestly, the way I played it, I tried to keep both guys relatively equal uh, in terms of HP and statistics when I could. Um, but I can totally see why you'd want to, like, juice up a single guy. Uh, this run just works really well because we have two people to hold two books. I mean, Lemmageddon and Satanic Bible are both iconic to the run. Lemmageddon has done a ton for our, like, damage, and Satanic Bible gave us a lot of opportunity itself. So... Yeah, I don't honestly it jury's out. It's it was just a oh, okay, we're we're conjoined. Okay, sweet, that's what we want. Conjoined on Mr. Homing guy. It's really good, and Bone Spurs is also really good. So let's uh let's go find Blue Baby and kick his little butt. Ow. And guys, we actually made the blue baby. I can't believe it. On the first try, we made it all the way around the circle. So, thank you all very much for watching. Uh, this was a really cool, you know, thing. It, it felt uh, fun. You know, a little progress all the way around. It was a nice challenge. Uh, you are smoking dope if you think I'm going in there. Uh, there's the seed. I really hope you guys enjoyed, though. Um, it was a lot of fun to get through every character. You know, there's a few I really haven't played since I got, like, done. Like, a few of these characters I just never thought I'd touch again. So, Jacob and Esau, I'm sorry. Honestly, you guys were a lot more fun than I gave you credit for. It ended up being a really awesome run. So, that's that. If you guys want to see something else uh, in Binding of Isaac, let me know. Uh, I don't really know where I'm going to go from here, though. Maybe I'm going to try some greed runs. I, I really... It's up in the air. Uh, I'm looking for some input, though. So... Don't be scared to drop a comment on something you want to see. And um, I hope you guys have a really good day. Uh, but that, that, my friends, is a job well done. That's, that's every character in a row. So how about that, huh? How about that? Have a good one, everybody.